back with another vlog. As you can see, I am in my car once again. So this is the norm for me starting off my vlogs. <laughs> I have a few things that I have in store for today. A couple of errands. I had already ran some earlier. Um, I went to the spa and everything and I wanted to take you guys to me on that, but I was rushing, I was running late, so I didn't get a chance to do that. So I have a few more errands and yeah, I'm taking y'all with me on these errands. So I have to run to Target to make a return. And I also have to run to TJ Maxx because this one vlogger, um, Pretty Bree MUA, got me on this uh, <laughs> wild goose hunt for this perfume combination. I found one, but I'm looking for the other one. So we're gonna do that today. And I'm bringing y'all with me, so let's go. done in Target so I'm on my way to TJ Maxx to see if they got this other perfume but I really didn't get a chance to look around the way I wanted to in Target because it is a few days before Christmas so it is jam-packed I'm, I'm on my way to TJ Maxx to see about this perfume let's go so they didn't have it in this particular uh, TJ Maxx so I'm gonna try one more I'm trying one more and if they don't have it I'm just gonna have to order it on Amazon but on Amazon it's double the price all right so I'm back at home and a little wild goose chase is over <laughs> No, I did not find the perfume that I was looking for. I went to three different um, TJ Maxx slash Marshalls and none of them had them. They had the first one, this one, the Luminous Glow. I did get that, I got this yesterday and um, I'm looking for the match. I probably won't find it, so I'm just gonna have to just order it off Amazon. The only thing about that is that I'm just a little shook because I really want to like it if I pay double the price for it, but we'll see. I think, I don't know. I'm going to just get it. Whatever. You can always return it. But, um, yeah, so that's that for today. I do want to do a haul with y'all. I'm trying to figure out if I want to do it on this vlog or if I do want to do it on a separate video. It'll probably be a separate video so I can show y'all what I did get. That's my adventure for today. This is a new day. I am out running errands and i'm dreading it i'm trying to get my mind right before i go in this store because it's jam-packed out here I'm out. I did get my water. I got water for the boys. It was ridiculously packed in there. I cannot stand shopping when it is this packed. It's too much. I can't. It's too many people. It's crammed. The lines is dumb long. I'm glad I got scan and go because I just scan my stuff on my phone, pay on my phone, and I'm out the door. How convenient. But with all that being said, I'm, I'm through. I, and I don't know if y'all could tell, but it's like doom and gloom. And we about to get this, we supposed to, it's predicted or forecasted that we finna get this big snowstorm. So I'm just trying to get all the stuff that I need to get 
so that I can just go home and sit down because it's just, it looks really depressing out here. <laughs> Good early day, everybody, and welcome back. This is the next day, and I'm feeling much more refreshed. Let me show y'all the outcome of this uh, snowstorm that we were supposed to be getting. We were supposed to be getting like five, six inches. I'm gonna show y'all, hold on. It's my raggedy looking back here. I'm gonna try to show y'all, try not to show y'all the uh, garage because certain somebody decided to make it a storage unit and I ain't feeling that, but yeah, this is all the snow that we got. It's not too bad considering this is Michigan. I thought we was gonna get majorly dumped on, but we didn't. It's not, it's not too bad. So I'm sure they salted the roads and it's drivable out there, I'm sure. But this is our first big snowfall of the season. Well, yeah, of the season, so that's what we got. So I did wanna show y'all real quick what I got. The first thing that I got from TJ Maxx, as I mentioned before, I was going in for this um, perfume that this one YouTuber suggested that I wanted to see if they had it. Um, it was a two combo perfume. I found one, but I didn't find the other one. I found the other one on Amazon, so I'm just gonna order it off Amazon for double the price, and it is what it is. So, yeah, the next thing that I got was these razors um, to, you know, when I do my self-care days, my facial days. The next thing I got was this overnight cream. Um, I have been looking for an, a good nighttime cream for my face when I do my facials, my at-home skincare, so on and so forth. And I found this one and I scanned it in my Yuka app and it came up pretty good. So that's why I chose this one. I got gel overnight mask and I also got the, um, this is the two times collagen and I also got the watermelon one. Both overnight creams and like I said, they scanned, came up pretty high on the Yuka app. So I'm gonna try it out, let y'all know how it works. It's by the Cream Shop that so I'm gonna get out of go the next thing I did get was firming serum it's a facial serum it's made in Japan this came up really good on the Yuka app as well I got it from uh, TJ Maxx I scan everything now because I'm really trying to watch the chemicals and all that that I'm putting on or even in my body. So I'm addicted to that app. So it's got me in the chokehold. The next thing I got was a Power Uplifter Eye Cream. This is by The Cream Shop as well. This got a pretty good scan on the Yuka app. And last but not least, I got this Evian. Now y'all know I love me some Evian spring water. I got this Evian facial spray. I saw this at Ulta initially and I wanted to give it a try, but then when I went to TJ Maxx, they had a nice little section there. And for a few dollars cheaper, I picked it on up at uh, TJ Maxx. And this scored 100 out of 100 on the Yuka app. So I'm like, okay. And by me having dry, flaky skin in the wintertime, especially on my face, so that was all that I got from there. I went there looking for one thing and I bought all this other stuff. <laughs> yeah, this is a part of my soft girl, soft life, feminine regimen that I trying to develop. Now, as far as Target, y'all did see me go to Target and y'all did see what I picked up at Target. I did get that. Now, the only thing that I wanna say is um, the, the, this brand, it's a, it's a pretty decent brand. They only have a couple of body washes. I just learned this after I got home. A couple of body washes that um, scanned really high and really good on the Yuka app as safe with, you know, no parabens and no sulfates and very safe to use on the skin and things like that and no carcinogens and so on and so forth. However, keep in mind, because I made this mistake, but see, I didn't already exchanged, I already bought it and I'm not about to take it back. So, I mean, it's not... It's, it, it didn't score as worse as, as bad as the um, Olay body washes, but it did score pretty bad, this particular flavor of uh, body wash. I just figured the brand, yeah, like I said, so I'll definitely, you know, stick to the brand. So, yeah. All right, so um, with that being said, um, I'm going to end the vlog here. 
and I hope y'all enjoyed coming along with me on my errands as I do every day <laughs> or every other day and come with me as I build my soft life journey or try to record it you know I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get in the swing of it you know but we'll talk about that a little bit more in another video but with that being said thanks for watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe and I will see you all in the next video